Bang Energy is a brand that had a lot of potential and had a good rise for a little bit. Sadly, it kind of was by the wayside. Got bought by Monster. Apparently, it's making a comeback in January with a Sour Ropes flavor. Weird enough, they dropped a little after Ghost for releasing their Sour Strips flavor. But at least Bang is trying something. And they don't think they've ever done like a proper Sour flavor, which is interesting. So, in the summer, let's go and take a look at their Sweet Tea energy drink that they did. Or at least it's a sweet tea with the amount of caffeine that's usually in bang, which I think is about 200 milligrams. But yeah, overall, I never had... No, no, Ray's did a sweet tea energy drink, so I'm intrigued to see how this is. So let's go ahead and taste it. I forgot there's like zero carbonation in this, which I really expected. Like, uh, did the Ray's... Yeah, the, the Sunny Tea one at least had carbonation. Not their tea line, which I think was a total dud, because I don't see any more at Dollar General. Oh, that's bitter. It's supposed to be like a sweet tea. Oh, there's the sweetness. It's actually like a more natural sweet tea versus like like Popeyes and McDonald's where it's like, hey, let's put a gallon of sugar. It's not bad. I like that. Pretty solid. It's um got an interesting flavor to it, I like. Yeah, that's very solid. Like it's it's the right amount of sweetness. Like I like unsweetened tea. Like I do like sweet tea, but I have to be like very I have to do it myself, like, how, how I like it. Um, this is more my speed. Definitely would recommend Do I Wish I Had Carbonation, and I now see that I was supposed to shake it. Gosh darn it. I like it a lot. It's a very solid flavor. It's a very underrated flavor. Go grab Bang when you can. Like, some of their flavors, like their Miami Vice and a couple other flavors there are just top-notch flavors. Definitely would re uh, recommend checking out. Um, I'm excited to see what Sour Ropes is supposed to be, but we'll, we'll have to wait and see. So definitely stay tuned. You can also see June here, but leave a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. You can follow me at FT underscore for the reviews or more uh, shorts and other stuff going up. Yeah, overall, I really like this flyer. I saw a 9 out of 10. I'm excited to see what Bang does in the new year. So again, check me out. You can also check out my podcast, Lux Party Podcast. Guys, have a day.